Hi guys, had a couple of comments about the new YouTube app on mobile phones. I don't use mine very often, but I've had a look at it and there's a couple of things that I think are worth just demonstrating. may help some people. I'm no expert, but I'll show you what I do. So, here we have the YouTube app icon. At the moment it's gone to my home location. I'm not going to comment on whether I like the way it's been set up, but I can see I've got recommended videos that YouTube wants me to watch. And it's got some of the people that I'm subscribed to. And people, it's recommending to me again. And it wants me to watch videos I've watched already again. So, that's the home page. How about if you want to find something by Grandad is an Old Man, for example. Up here you've got a little magnifying glass. Click on that, search YouTube. You can see I've already done it, but I'll type something in again. Let's try G-R-A-N-D-A-D-I-S-A-N-O-L-D-M-A-N. Granddad is an old man. It's times like this you realise it's a bad idea to have a long name. Space. And what should we look for? Propellers. That's a question I get often. P R O P E L L E R. Grandad is an old man propeller. And then down here we've got the magnifying glass again. Press that. And off it goes and finds as many videos as it can with Grandad is an old man on it and propellers on it. So that's a quick way of searching for videos that I've done with propellers. Next thing I wanted to show was, okay we found something, let's look at it. So there's Hi my, guys. my video. Bargain store project time again. Uh, let's turn him off. Next thing, people want to know more details. Well, you can ask me a question. But more often than not, I've already answered the question and it's in the video description. But you don't see the video description by default. But just here, there's a little down arrow, which if I touch it, there you go. There's all the information that I've put in there. Pages of it. So, you may well find, rather than asking me a question, the answer's already there. Details of the components, the tools used, useful links to other videos. So, there you go. A couple of useful things. How to search and how to find the video description. Hope that helps.